Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing The Sims 4. Alright Jim, let's go. We gotta steal more presents. Oh, oh god, I think he got caught. Uh... They realized he's not Santa. This is inappropriate. Please stop. Oh, what a beautiful spot. A beautiful spot to die. Never call me out again like that. My plan was so they'd go all go over and then I could steal the presents, but uh, I don't think they care very much. Or maybe she just had to finish the page and reflect on how good of a book it was. Still not panicking. Still not panicking. Going inside. Okay. Huh. Well then. Oh, now she's just got another book. Uh, she's still burning, if anyone if anyone cares. Oh my god, there he is again. He's absolutely taunting me. Sorry, Grim, I know it's Christmas, but you know what? You can't have the day off. Oh, god damn it, recently caught. I can't steal Christmas from them. Well, you know what? Actually, I think of, uh... I think of stolen Christmas. I don't think the presents matter at this point. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I've stolen Christmas. Okay, on to the next house. I feel like I've murdered people in this house before. Yeah, I definitely murdered the entire family that used to live here. I've got a plan. There's only one man who can help me now. And here he is. I know what you're thinking. How can this man help me? You know what they say, keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Your enemies can be the perfect distraction. Time to get upstairs and steal those prezzies. Yes, steal everything. All right, may as well take this for the collection because I've got like five of his graves already and he comes back every single time. I've successfully stolen Christmas and I think only two people died and one may yet come back. We will see. So it's it wasn't that high of a death count. There was just a lot of stealing. Oh no, speak of the devil. There he is. He's fine. One death. And she was really rude, so does it really matter? You can't start a party, I don't think I know enough people. Oh wait, I have an idea. Don't worry, you can relax. I just wanted some company. Come on in. Why don't people like me? I'll give her a tip. A dollar. Would this change your mind? <laughs> oh, she charged me 500, okay. Oh, now I can throw a party. I'm inviting my old professors. People who shot me down on dates, the fire person that I literally just met, and my old, uh, headmaster. <laughs> yes, welcome. Never charge me for falsely calling the fire service ever again. <laughs> He's giving a little wave to the one in the pool, a little wink. He's just watching her die slowly, sitting there smiling, not caring about her at all. You cost me $500. Oh, that's the Grim Reaper. God, he acts so fast in this one. You can't, you can't even get a chance to chat with him. You may have been my greatest enemy, but even you don't deserve this. Yeah, get off my property. Oh, someone made a little snowman over there. Yeah, you're not welcome here either. Get out of here. Off my property. It's like, shouldn't you, you know, do the exam before the surgeries? No, I'm shoot first, ask questions later kind of guy. Oh, God, there's only one way out of this. Sorry, man, you just- you found out I was a bad vet, and I had no way out of this. I just had to kill you. Oh my god, what's happening to your dog? No! Somebody help that dog! Please! Make it stop! Make it stop! This isn't what I wanted when I opened a veterinary clinic. Oh, thank god, I fixed- No, he's doing it again! The other one's doing it now, too! I just wanted to be a vet! This guy doesn't even mind anymore, or else he's in shock, but the dog's- Like, his neck is broken, it's bent backwards. Oh, do something, do- Friendly introduction to the dog, please, just make him stop. He's getting bored. <laughs> just talk to the dog or something, make it stop. I'm gonna have nightmares. Not the best service we've ever had! <laughs> that is very reasonable feedback. Hey, Grim, you won't believe the mess I've caused this time. It's kind of good because I can stock my graveyard business by by just killing people here, I guess. It's kind of a win-win. A Jesus, the graveyard business is thriving at least. I should probably bring some of the urns over there when I get a chance. Oh no, one of the cult members is gonna die. Ah, uh, well, I don't have time to go home. Hopefully she'll be alive when I get back. Oh no, another one of the cult members is dying. Two are dying. Oh, Murphy's dying. Oh, for God's sake, I just gave away my kid. Could you not have died like a few minutes earlier? All was such an inconvenience. Oh, she is also dying. You will never see this room again. I don't know about an afterlife, but your life was heaven, that's for sure. Here's someone crying somewhere. Ah, yes, she died in his room. 
Well, you're gonna be a while. The Reaper's already busy with the other one. So yeah, that kind of happened. Elope immediately. Wait, is that guy... Oh my god, he's extremely handy. Oh my god, look at this guy! 10 charisma, 10 cooking, 10 fitness, 10 gardening, 10 gourmet cooking, 10 handiness, 10 logic, 10 mischief, 10 mixology, 10 piano, 10 rocket scientist, 10 video game. Oh my god, he's like the perfect human. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on, look at him. BJ Pickens' long life is coming to end. <laughs> I was just about to give him the praise he finally deserved. Like, BJ, you did good. And he's uh, apparently dying. Jules Cooper is dying from laughter. What the feck? Don't you die on me, man. What is he laughing at? Jim, you gotta really pull in one of your connections here. What? What made him laugh so much? Jules, no. You were too perfect for this world. That man is dying. Even Pumpkin's upset. Oh, I don't know which- You know what? Yes, demand. Jim is terrifying. Grim, you know I'll kill you next if you don't spare this perfect specimen of a human. No! No, he was perfect! He was a perfect human being! Did you see him preparing that food? It was like art. It was perfect. Oh, I can't believe he died from laughter. I didn't even know that was possible. Anyway, better prepare some food. Oh, look, he's tr he's like Jules himself. Once again, Jim proves that he's better than anyone else. Yeah, that is way more stylish than Jules. Yeah, Jules, you suck. <laughs> the one person Jim cries over. Wait, that isn't Jim. Yeah, I should have known he wasn't capable of crying. All right, let's see. Oh my god, I have 11 gravestones. There we go. That is actually scary. I don't know, it's just a lot when you look at it like that. Like, that is a lot of gravestones. <laughs> this is not how The Sims was meant to be played. I want to take BJ on a lovely vacation before he dies, which is probably going to be pretty soon. So, so. Oh, well, I guess I am a little bit too late. I just arrived at the house and he is dying. Uh, I'll try with the Grim Reaper, but he never seems to listen to me. Maybe it will for once because, you know, you're my son and all. Are you gonna be upset for once? Uh -huh. No, of course you're feckin' not. No, don't leave, come back! Okay, he's gonna plead outside, he doesn't wanna do it in front of the old wifey there. No, deaf ears. Alright, well, we're going on a holiday then. It was supposed to be a holiday of, like, a last hurrah, now it's just running from my problems. Wait, what? Is he also dying now? Well, at least someone got their farewell holiday, but that was my new slave. Ah, god damn it. Sick tattoo though, bro. <laughs> he wakes up like, oh, another one has died. Just be sure to take that, we're gonna need it. Just an awkward silence between the three of them. Who's Raphael's spirit? Hold on, pause a second. Yeah, exactly. Let's let's have a little think about this. <laughs> His spirit's gonna fade away if no one, like, mourns him and stuff, but I don't know who he is, so I'll pass. Thank you very much, though. Yep. Pass. Go away! Go away! I don't care about these spirits! What am I, some sort of graveyard owner? Oh my god, it won't stop popping up. It's like I killed the whole village or something. I can't read my pop-ups because it just won't leave me alone with these dead things. Oh my god, I don't care about these spirits. Oh my god, I don't even know who Bob is. This is how they're coming back to haunt me. They're not actually bothering me in ghost form. They're just sending me messages all the time. A lot of the family has just been dying off. But worst of all, Jules died last episode. I also think I need to get a mod, uh, which someone recommended to me in the comments last time, I think, that um, refills the neighborhood because <laughs> it's kind of dying off. Either from old age or just, you know, good old-fashioned Jim Pickens, as we can see across the road. All right, leave the bodies, just take the gravestones. Wait, I want to see him speedrun on this job. <laughs> he does a little laugh after he's after collecting all of them. Oh, what a wild life I have, he says to himself. Oh my god, he's in his vampire stuff. No, 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 you look horrible, dude. Get away from me. Fun. <laughs> you don't feel too good, do you? Yeah, here's my other friend. That's for lying to me about your appearance, punk. Don't ever catfish me or my son ever again. <laughs> He's playing him a little farewell song. Ooh, that's fancy. Take that. Now take that. <laughs> Wait, why are you hitting her? Alright, I may not care about her at all, but she's still my date. And that's an employee! How do you have a job? Now, you have to think about what you did, you hear me? It's time for your hibernation. 
<laughs> Have you had enough of being frozen? Oh yeah, definitely. You look freezing, buddy. Don't worry, I'll heat you up. You know, just don't slap my date ever again. I don't even care about her. It's just a pride thing. He's still burning. He's taking quite some time. He just continues dancing. Only my sweet moves can de-escalate this situation. She's crying. Why are you crying? He was slapping you. Why are you so jumping for joy? No one's gonna need that, are they? All right, thanks. I'll take it. Oh, God damn it! It's the Grim Reaper coming to take Yusuf. I just drank his plasma, too. The total opposite reactions. <laughs> Go on, plead for him. Please, he's my snack. Don't, don't take my snack. The Grim Reaper never gives me my dead people back. I give him so much. It's all take, take, take with him. He never gives anything. Oh, pumpkin's dying. God damn it. Why are pumpkins always the first to go? Oh, that's really sad. Witness death. Why? No, don't go in there to witness it. You can't just hide from your problems, Grim. I'll leave it there on the entrance so we'll never forget them. <laughs> that one's really cared for and like pride of place in the house and the others are just weeds everywhere. Hey, now that you're married to my like adopted daughter, you want a woohoo in that coffin? No? What the hell? Yeah, that's right. Nobody turns me down. It was a short marriage, that's for sure. Yeah, just just watch TV. That's fine. He's just watching static. We've got a special plan today. We're gonna buy a restaurant. Okay, so you bought a restaurant. Now what? It's hard work. Oh, come on! I want this guy because I'm sure I saw him like dancing at a at a store at one point. Oh god, you're not looking so good. Oh yeah, didn't I freeze you and try and kill you? Wait, I thought I actually did kill him. Or else he's white facing, in which case that is extremely inappropriate, young man. Wish this place had more friendly service. What's what's the problem? I'll cheer you up, don't worry. Yeah, that's right. We have a magician. <laughs> Goodbye. You see, that's why you shouldn't complain about having it moderately bad, because it could always be worse. Someone clean up that pee I just drowned her in. Look, why is the hot dog coming out so confidently? I know how to react to this. Her final wish was, I wish this place had more friendly service. She's still thinking that. Go on, plead for her. I just want to see, can I save anyone eventually? Oh, I actually brought her back to life. Jesus, I don't think I've ever managed to do that before. I'm so happy. Oh, Jim is very happy about this. It's like, this food smells burnt. No, ma'am, that is you. <laughs> Wait, get out of the kitchen. You don't want to see the magic. The service at this place is fantastic. Someone clean up that pee. This is why we're getting bad reviews. We still got some three stars in here. They're like, wow, what a good show. I could just kill anyone who gives me a bad review. That's one idea. This is hygienic, right? Having someone's ashes right behind the stove. Oh, fucking hell, my plant died. And Jim, someone's at the door that we don't need anymore. I, I need this disco system, so I need everyone to clear out. But how do I get them all out of the room? Oh, I have an idea. There we go. Okay, now they should all run outside to see what the commotion is. And then I should be free to swipe the disco system. Does no one care? Dude's on fire, yo. If only anyone cared, my plan would be perfect. Sorry, dude. <laughs> I hate to bring this realization to you like this. Yeah, I know he's dying. I don't care. He was only meant to be a distraction anyway. Why are you laughing? Oh, I like her. <laughs> Come on, they're all gone out to, to see him. Come on. Yes! The disco system is mine! And at a great price too. It only cost one human life. It's gonna take this, guys. I don't want to make you any more sad. There we go. Okay, I can't take responsibility for this. I can't find the tweet, but someone tweeted at me that this dish can kill Sims. Beware, eating low quality puffer fish or eating it in a bad mood may cause a slight case of death. So we're gonna add that to the menu. We're gonna remove everything else. <laughs> you can't even wash down your death meal. All right, there we go, puffer fish. All right, done. Quality poor. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh, quality normal. Oh wait, no, that was the water. What? What? That wasn't even me! How are you on fire? What the hell? That legit wasn't me, I didn't do it, I've been asleep! How did he burst into flame? <laughs> wait, that was my old chef! Maybe it's some sort of protest. Oh no, wait! He's a vampire now, so he burned! I locked the door and he couldn't come in! <laughs> he couldn't come inside, so he just stood outside burning. Oh my god, he's such an idiot. Okay, can I go over and try and save him? Oh, I'm also burning. Come on, I gotta get back inside. No, it didn't work. Okay, I gotta get back inside because I'm not an idiot. See y'all later. <laughs> he just like flew in the window. Yeah, why didn't that guy just do that? <laughs> Never mind. Ingredient quality options. Yes, ingredient quality. F grade. Perfect. <laughs> uh, I think the F grade ingredients are working. <laughs> 
Oh, Jesus Christ. She's bringing over her meal like death. Can you check on this for me? Oh, no, she's gonna just continue eating. <laughs> she's like, it can't have been the food. Sure, he's just keeled over in his food, but it can't have been the food. Even the guy sitting next to him is like, oh, this is pretty good. <laughs> Continues to eat. Sorry, folks. I hope this inconsiderate bastard dying didn't ruin your day. I'll take his urn out of the way. Uh-oh. Uh, I think someone else is dying. <laughs> Oh, there she goes. The waiter's like, that's the second one today. What a coincidence. Everyone is just dying of old age all of a sudden. Oh, now the chef is coming out. I heard we got some complaints from the customers. <laughs> She's thinking this meal definitely doesn't look too great. Bring her back. She hasn't paid yet. Please. Oh, he, would, he never listens to me. I don't know who died. He's just staring at this wall. Are these distracting people? I think they might be. Selfish, selfish dead people. Imagine having to clean up these many urns and gravestones in a restaurant. <laughs> What's that for? Oh good, someone's just dead in their food again. Whew, I thought it was for me for a second. Wait, I think my chef literally died from old age just now. Maybe I can plead for her. Please, she's the only one who will work for this horrible wage. Oh, thank God, she's been brought back. Okay, good. Get back in the kitchen. I imagine he said something along the lines of, please, if you let her live, she will kill so many people with her cooking. It'll get you so much extra business. It's okay, folks. She's alive. But some of you may not be in a second. <laughs> Wait, what? She's just dying again. I just went through this to save you. Kendrick's pissed. I don't blame him. I'm pissed too. All right, looks like I need a new chef. Anyone here not able to cook? See, this is what your daddy does for a living. I kill people. Oh God, here goes Mr. Generic. Why was I created just to suffer? Why are we still here? Just to suffer. All right, you know what? Restaurant's closed. We're going home, everyone. Everyone get out. Oh, even Grim hurried up. He didn't go through the usual routine. He just put him in the box. Uh, would you like to take this customer to go and put some in a little urn for Jim? <laughs> Thank you, Grim. Yes, I would. How many graves am I holding on to? Ah, two. That's not too bad. And now the regular graves. Ah, oh, 31. Yes, of course. <laughs> that seems reasonable. It's almost human's time. Make the most of these final days. Human, I thought you were like immortal or something. You've just always been around. Shout forbidden words. Get angry about the fact you're dying. Oh, the Grim Reaper can't get me up here. I'll just glitch out of the game. Wait, what? What is going on? What? Is human dying? Oh no, he's just lying down for a little nap. What, what happened here? <laughs> it's like he's getting ready for one of those magic tricks where they cut you in half. Plead for human. Wait, she was asleep in the bed while he was in there? Wait, why are you hugging him? That's the wrong reaper. Oh, well, it's too late now. <laughs> I missed my opportunity, apparently. Offer him a rose instead, like, thank you for taking my son. <laughs> Creepy, I know. 32 graves and counting. This is a children's book. Yeah, that's a fine description. You're wasting doctor's times. That's punishable by death, I hope you know. That's right, never waste my time again. Next patient, they all just run out the door. She died in the room with the kid. The kid is just dancing away, he's happy. Wait, where are you going? Come back, I'm not done with you. Okay, I've upset the whole hospital. Jim did a terrible job today. Hopefully no patient suffered due to his negligence. Seriously, I was the only person actually working. Sure, I killed one person, but what's that? How many people die in hospital every day? It's such a small statistic. Wait, death by sun? It's 2 a.m. There is no sun. Jesus Christ. What is going on? Jim is dying, but he's just standing there. It'll lope immediately. <laughs> Quick, get the house, Grim. Jim Pickens has died from overexposure to the sun. No, 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 no. No, no, no. This is not how this ends. Get outside. Get outside. It's really important. No, I can't move anyone. Okay, I think Jim dying may have broken the game. We are in the wrong timeline here. I just put it on fast forward so I could go get another job. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to load my game. It's just not working for some reason. 